Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you are having a wonderful Tuesday. It is Tuesday, so that means it is hashtag Tea Tuesday. And this is an open collaboration that is hosted by my friends Patty over at Life with Patty, as well as Kathy over at Kathy's Favorite Things. And I will put both of their channels down below so you can go check them out and everyone else in this open collaboration. And we hope you join us. So today, my beverage of choice is some sweet tea. Um, I, for some reason, have been craving a sweet tea. I guess because I rarely ever drink it. I've noticed even like if we go out to a restaurant, which isn't often, we don't go out to restaurants that often. We did go out for my son's birthday to celebrate um, at the Outback. That's where he wanted to go. But um, we don't we don't go out that often to restaurants. Maybe once a month, if that, if that, because typically if we do a takeout, we do exactly that. We'll go pick it up or even have it sent here to the house. Um, so, I bet I've noticed when we have gone out uh, very seldom to a restaurant, I just get, I order ice water. Um, I don't order, you know, anything else, but lately I've been craving some sweet tea. I don't know if it's because it's summertime or what, but so I had told my husband that I meant to stop by uh, the drive through at Bojangles and get a gallon of sweet tea. Well, they used to sell it in the gallon and now it is in the half gallon, which is like the same price as the gallon. So I'm curious to see what the gallon is at Chick-fil-A because uh, every once in a great while, I would get a gallon from there as well. Uh, but I haven't did that in a long, long time either. Uh, but like I said, I've been craving it. So the other day my husband and I had went out and he needed to replace his weed eater. And so, um, he said, well, you know, let's go buy Bojangles and get just some tea. Well, they didn't, like I said, didn't have them in a gallon. So we just went ahead and got two of the half gallons. Um, I could have made it a lot cheaper, trust me. Um, but, you know, I just wanted it already made and that perfect consistency that they do. They don't do it too sweet, but they don't, and they don't put the lemon in it. I know a lot of people in the South love their lemon in their tea. I only like lemon in my water and I do not like lemon in my tea. I love sugar in my tea. <laughs> um, and so anyways, we, we went by and got that. So that is what I am drinking today for Tea Tuesday. How appropriate, right? Tea. <laughs> Because normally you see me with either um, in the fall and winter hot tea or you'll see me with water normally. And then um, more recently, my daughter and I had gotten into making the uh, strawberry lemonades, homemade strawberry, strawberry lemonade and homemade uh, peach lemonade. Um, so that's what I had been having recently too. Um, but speaking of drinks, I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. And... I picked up two of these for my son. I know they're not very big, but it's still a good deal, especially considering what they are at the grocery stores. So I did need to pick up two cards, actually two sympathy cards. Hopefully by the time, I'm sure by the time that um, this Tea Tuesday goes up, um, that beautiful, you can't really see it, I'm sorry. There we go. Um, you will, I, by the time that this Tea Tuesday goes up, um, the ones that I'm sending out to will have already received it. And then there's this one. So there's those. And then I'm making a dessert for my um, Budget Meals Under $5 collab that I do on Wednesdays with um, Miss Brenda over at Maniac Grammy's Homestead. Um, and I actually needed vanilla wafers for this dessert that I'm making. Um, but the Dollar Tree did not have them, and I, you know what, believe it or not, I could have, I had the time. I did not feel like going to another Dollar Tree. I just wanted to get back home, I wanted to put the stuff away, and I had lots to do here, so that would definitely keep me busy. So I said, you know what, I'm not gonna, I'll check another time, and if they do, then I'll keep them in stock. But for now, I got these European cookies, the classic shortbread, and I said, you know what, that will be 
just good enough for it is what it is, right? And then I picked up this by Beauty Guru. This is not for me, but I picked this up for a friend. 100% natural hair serum. It says it's with keratin, which is really good. Keratin is always good for your hair. So I got that. And then I picked this up for my mom. It's Diabetics Dry Skin Treatment Foot Cream. It says it helps relieve and soothe dry, cracked skin. Actually for my mom and my dad, because they're both diabetic. And then um, I picked up a thing of the Reynolds Wrap foil sheets. You get 25 in here. Um, I was I was almost completely out. I just went through my one box. So I wanted to go ahead and get um, another one. And I actually, um, I really like the Reynolds brand as opposed to the off brand. If the off brand is there, I'll get it. But it tends to be a little um, messier when it comes to pulling it out. A lot of times it will um, tear off and Anyways, I just went ahead and uh, got that because um, that is a good deal for $1.25 for 25 of, of the Reynolds brand. Um, and then I just picked up a thing of gum. I needed some gum for my purse. I got some of these, these uh, mini gel pens. It's a 10 count. And I had purchased these before. These are great. I got those. And then I picked up by, by uh, B Color embellished nail wraps and I thought these were really pretty and you get 12 in there I thought those were really pretty hopefully I'm trying to get rid of that glare and you can see it and it's pretty and then I got three of these magnetic photo frames the four by sixes because I have some pictures on the other side of the refrigerator that I need to put in these so I got three of those because I figured that would do it and then I got this cute little book that says quotes from the heart. Um, and it's got just a whole bunch of sweet little quotes. Um, Always in my heart. Uh, Love looks not with the eyes, but with the mind by William Shakespeare. Um, it's just a nice little book that I thought would also be nice for maybe card making or maybe uh, ATCs or MDCs um, or just whatever. And then I picked up these beautiful 11 piece um, stickers from Crafters Square. I thought these were really, really beautiful. And then I also picked up these, and this is a 15 piece set of stickers. I thought those were really beautiful too. Got the butterflies and the dragonflies. And then I found these and thought these would be great for friend mail. Um, they are 250 plus sticker books. And so that's what this one looks like. And how fun. Y'all can probably figure out who these are going out to. <laughs> so there's this one. And then I also found, see they're different. I also found this one. And... what these look like. Lots of pretty stickers. Love that butterfly. Yeah, and then this one. This one's different too. And this one's fun. This one's got like, like coffee and uh, cupcakes and cute little glasses. How cute. I thought these were really fun. So yeah, I got these. Actually have glasses like that. So yeah, that is my Dollar Tree haul for this Tea Tuesday. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Comment down below and let me know if there is something here that you guys are looking for or that you'll, you know, that you'll look for at your local Dollar Tree. Um, and please go check out Patty and Kathy and everyone else in this open collab. And I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. And at the end of this video, I'm going to include some little crafts that I've worked on. They are, um, 
it's not diamond art, but the beads kind of look like diamonds. They're different colors. Uh, but the cutout animals or insects, the ones, the, these are the ones that I've had for a while that I got at Dollar Tree and had did anything with. And I thought I'm going to make magnets out of them, you know, and give them out as gifts. So um, if you stay with me to the end of this video, you will see that. And uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your Tuesday and a wonderful week ahead. And if you've not already subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button and that bell notification and you won't miss any of my uploads. And until next time, bye y'all.